What's up everybody, it's ADB95 and welcome to a new thing. Welcome to the speedrun guides. So, a quick digression on why this is happening. The attention has been shifted back to speedrunning the game. And that is probably to blame on me because I was the one that out of nowhere decided that he wanted to start uh, practicing for speedrunning. And that has lighted up a spark. And also Crumble, the owner of the server, has asked me if I wanted to help in reviving the speedrun guys discord channel and so here i am i'm doing uh the speedrun guide for mission three since well mission one and two are already in the channel and i'm gonna show you guys what you, what is currently the quickest way of doing this mission so if you are followed uh mission one and mission two you probably now with ended up with four sappers and one grunt which uh, you get because, well, sappers are the best thing when it comes to speedrunning because they can attack multiple people. But that's not the thing here because the first turn is just gonna be uh, TNTing the first enemy, the first grunt on the left of the map, and then you're gonna sprint all the way towards the, the gunner so that he can get you as a target with his pistol. Now, I found out that the best consistent spot for that is that little path that I am standing on right there. So they can shoot you with the pistol, and most importantly, the second guy will not immediately target you, because that's another very important thing about the fastest way to, th to do this. But let's get back to, to turn number two, where our second sapper will take the first uh, uh, cluster bomb, and as you can see, I'm doing it in the Italian version, because yeah, I fancied to do that. But yeah, you're gonna find this this exact spot right here, one step to uh, close to the minefield, and then you're gonna throw a full power cluster grenade to the gunner, which should get him enough to kill him. And now the key point of this is that this third enemy uh, will run around for a little bit and then go towards the fourth one. Now he does that only if uh, both of your enemies are a little bit out of sight, which is why positioning the, ver the very two, the very first two uh, sappers is important. But if he does this, then you get a chance to end it with a third turn. So the third sapper is going to be collecting the second cluster bomb, and watch out the spot again, because you have to position yourself on on the on the little bit on the angle of this trench over here and then throw a full power grenade in the middle of them. Now, it's important that the first detonation damages them a little bit like this, and then you're gonna uh, be able to kill them both with the clusters. This is the fastest current way to do uh, mission three, and I don't think there is a faster way than this. So that is when I wrap it up for this one, and I'm gonna see you in the next speed speedrun guide.